All right, hi everyone. Welcome back to another exciting RuneScape stream and video. This is your boy Socrates here to do the Halloween event of 2020 on Old School RuneScape. So right now we're located right next to the Wizard's Tower, Lumber Swamp, Southeast Drainer Village. Going to start the event right now by talking to Rick. Nice wizard robes too, and the pumpkin helmet. Hello, is everything okay? You look a little lost. Hello? Who's there? I can't see anything. My name is Socrates. Perhaps you would be better, you would see better if you took that pumpkin off. Oh wow, I never thought of that. It seems pretty obvious if you ask me. It's not as easy as you might think. I can't just take this pumpkin off because it has swapped places with my head. How'd you manage to do that? I was doing some research on farming. Pumpkins are actually very easy to cast spells on, much like cabbages. I was reading this very interesting book about it called Quarm and Peas. You should totally read it. The nature of pumpkins is fascinating. The thought of magically farming them without having to dirty your hands, amazing. I think the pumpkin's getting to his head. There's also a section about magically cooking the vegetables, which is really good for me because I don't know how to cook. Can you get to the point? How did you swap your head with a pumpkin? Oh, uh, right. So I was casting the spell on a pumpkin and I just have gotten part of it wrong. Before I knew it, my head had swapped places with the pumpkin. That is horrible. What are you going to do now? Well, I must find a way to reattach my head. I don't suppose you could help me. Sure, I'll help you. That's awesome. I think the first thing we need to do is recover my head. I thought it would be best to leave it in my room to keep it safe. However, moving around without your head, with, without a head proved more difficult than I thought. Could you fetch it for me, please? I'll get your head for you. Where is it? I left it in my room at the Wizard's Tower, just south of here, across the bridge. I'll head right there. Wait, before you go, I apologize for the mess. I haven't cleaned my room in a while. Thanks for the heads up. I'm starting to regret this. <laughs> it's funny. All right, wow, and they even got all the... Whoa, they're all looking at me, too. That's pretty cool. The Halloween event, and I think all the other holiday events on RuneScape, they're very short nowadays, but they're very fun. I, I'd say, you know, a little fun to take a break on RuneScape, if you know what I mean. All right. I wonder where his room is at. On the second floor. Second floor. There it is. Portal to Rick's room. Whoa. Rick's gramophone is playing a jaunty little tune. Maybe this is what cool kids listen to these days. Very cool. So if we kind of zoom out a bit, not sure where this room is located in space. His room is quite messy, but he has a pretty nice room. It's a very square room, and I'm, not, I'm assuming he's a wizard himself too, but... Cool. So we gotta find his head. <clears throat> no head. I guess all you gotta do is just search around for it. So here you go. Hmm. Rick's box. A riddle. Wizards Mizgog. And these other guys walk into a bar. The bartender serves them two wizard mind mobs and one on his gainy and R ale. The bar closes at 11, at which point everyone leaves. How many people left the bar? Four. Four. <laughs> Inside the box, you find a head and hope it is Rick's. Oh, gosh. Rick's head. You should probably not misplace this. Yeah. Let's get out of here. That's pretty cool. If you go back to his room, you could match the window to the window. So it actually does match. But how come? I don't know. Like, what, what kind of? I guess it takes away from um, the whole magic is they they kind of they should have just left his room in like a, the actual wizard's tower instead of making it like a little private, you know, in its own space type of thing. Like I know it's an event and all, but. 
you know, they, they could have they could have just left it and, you know, made an existing room his room and, you know, put a couple decorations in it, maybe remove it at the end of the day. But I don't know. Anyways, let's go back to Rick, and I think that's all there is to the event. Nope, there's still more. So give him the head. Thank you so much for returning my head. Now all we need to do is find a way to reattach to my body. How do you do that? So you think the wizards may know a way to revert this? It's worth a shot. Perhaps that one of the higher-ups know. I'll speak to the wizards. Great. Holy moly. And he's gone. Now we got to go to the third floor of the wizard's tower and talk to wizard Mizgog. Pretty straightforward. You know, so I remember like a, a while back, a couple years ago, one of these events, probably the Easter or the Christmas event, they made you walk around RuneScape. Like, not just like within literal distances, but like they, they made you walk all around to do it, the event. I think 2005 Christmas, they really made you walk. Um, it was good though. You got a lot of, you know, the holiday hats and all the good stuff. So here's the guy. Swapping heads with vegetables, you say. Have you got a cabbage head in our hands? Not quite. You see, Rick, my friend accidentally swapped his head with a pumpkin. Ah, yes, I know many young wizards who have tempted that spell and failed. They tend to be arrogant and take on more than they can handle. The last wizard who got his head swapped like that couldn't get it back for months. That's terrible. How did they end up reverting the spell? Sadly, there's nothing I can do. There's only one person who knows that kind of magic well enough. Her name is Eve. Eve, who is that? Once a year around this time, the witch Eve shows up. Little is known about her. Some say that she's been longer around than, been around longer than any of us, and that she knows a lot about old magic that is mostly lost to us now. Where can I find this witch? Like I said, she only shows up once a year. Ah, it should be tonight. What a coincidence! She sometimes set up sets of camp east of here along the west coast of the Lumbridge Swamp. Ancient with Eve camp west of Lumbridge Swamp. Got it. Thanks. My pleasure. Be careful. All right. <clears throat> Pretty straightforward. Like again, you're just going back and forth, back and forth, and you're done. So let's go ahead and check out where the fire is at, or a small camp somewhere. It has to be somewhere here where Rick was found. That might be it. Yep. This has to be it. There's something mesmerizing about this fire. Some time passes. Whoa, it's a green fire. Is it nighttime already? I must have stayed here a while. But the fire, it, it seems almost magical. A jack-o'-lantern. You hear a strange sound coming from somewhere close. Whoa! Eve. Ha ha ha, I'm back. Hello, Gelliner. Ha ha ha. Whoa, who is that? Friends, come join me. Whoa. Yanes. Hogs. Yeldiv. Let's not forget you, my dear. Whoa. Well, what are we waiting for? Let's get this party started. Drink, eat, dance. What the heck? Cauldron of brew. What in the world have I stumbled upon? Hey, you. Who, me? Yes, you. Come over here. Well... Well, that's cool. There's a bunch of NPCs here. Let me see what happens if I talk to one of these guys. Hello. Hello. You don't look very well. Are you all right? No, I'm dead. Dead as in feeling a bit under the weather? No, dead as in I got stabbed and died. Well, that's awful. How are you still here? And how can you still talk? You brought me back from the afterlife. She's a pretty... She's a party line, that one. How could she bring you back from the afterlife? I'm not sure how the magic works exactly. Only Eve knows that. All I know is she usually does this every year. I didn't see her around last year. Are you sure she always comes here? She returns to the world of the living every year. It doesn't mean she has to go to Lumbridge Swamp every year. 
Fair enough. Okay. Anyways. Speak to Eve. Okay. Hello there. Welcome. I know a lot of things, like about your friend Rick the pumpkin head. How do you know about him? Never mind him. This night is too beautiful to care about such trivial things. Come dance with us. That is not really the time. This is not really the time to dance. Not a dancer, eh? Then come relax by the fire. Have a drink. Eat some snacks. Enjoy yourself. But I, I have to help Rick. I, I don't have time for this. <sighs> Suit yourself. I'm going to. Da I'm going dancing. Eve, wait. Oh, too late. She's busy dancing already. Dance by the fire. Wow, this is actually fun. Cool. There's a bunch of jack-o'-lanterns here, too. Whoa. Whoa. A ghostly figure. It's a ghost. Boots and a staff. Gilded armor, too. This is awesome. And you, you can see that there's a bunch of, like, floating lights. This is a pretty cool event, I gotta say. A drink from the cauldron. And eat or take spider from the barrel of spiders. And then talk to Eve again. Oh, I'm supposed to eat this, drink that. This is good. I wonder what's in it. I'd rather not know. Talk about Rick. This is some party you got going on here. Isn't it? Every day's a party. I'm afraid I've uh, overindulged, though. I lost track of time, and my friend Rick really needs me. I see. This, this seems to matter a great deal to you. It does. I haven't known Rick for long, but I can't let him down. Well, you certainly know how to party. I like that. I will help you, Socrates. Really? That's great. Wait a second. How do you know what I need help with? Like I said before, I know a lot of things. I suppose you're right. I, I'm sad to see you go, but here. Take this incantation. When Rick casts the spell on his head, it just swap places with the pumpkin. Eve, thank you so much. You're very welcome. Hey, come back and party with us sometime. Sure. Okay. Okay, so now to finish this, all we gotta do is go back to Rick's room in that little square box at the wizard's tower, and we're done. Very straightforward event. Whoa, there's a bunch of people here. There he is. Rick, I found a way to revert the spell. Really, that's amazing news. Here you go, I got this incantation from a witch named Eve. Eve, who's that? Don't you worry about who's who and what's... <laughs> what's important is that this will put your head back in place. Or shall I say, get your head in the right head space. You really gotta stop that. Anyway, how do we get rid of this pumpkin? This incantation will hopefully work. Whoa. Who's that? Alright, Socrates time. Let's cast a spell. <clears throat> here, here I go. Hocus. Uh, Pocus. Pumpkin look what? <laughs> Whoa. Whoa, that's nice. That's a nice cutscene. And Rick is back. I like the yellow sash on him, too. My head, did it work? It sure did. I can see. How do I look? You look like yourself. Well, I, I assume it's you. Never actually seen your face before. Thank you so much, Socrates Time. What would I do without you? 
You still be bumping into trees near Drainer Village, I imagine. Yeah, I still have some bruises from that. Anyways, here, take this as a thank you. I never want to see a pumpkin again. Thank you, Rick. I'll see you around. Not if I see you first. <laughs> you must be a member to receive all the holiday rewards. Upgrade now to unlock the magical pumpkin that you can plant in your player-owned house. Never. <laughs> okay. Headless head. What does this do? Whoa! My head is gone. That's scary. What else did they give us? Halloween mask. Green. And red. Two each. Two pumpkins as well. That's awesome. Cool. Alright, well, thanks everybody for joining me. Hope y'all enjoyed the stream. Happy Halloween to everybody of 2020. And I'll see you all next time. Peace out.